Howdy, hey there, YouTube. It is me, Sizzle Games. I'm here bringing you another episode of the Naruto Ultimate Mod Pack. So, in the last episode, I died. And that's all that really pretty much happened. I died and I ran away from my biggest fears, which are the Minotaurs and, and, and stuff like that. So, here we are. I'm actually going to be starting my adventure in this episode, because... In the last episode, I did tell you guys that I am not going to be a Kage, I'm going to be joining one of the other villages. I just don't know which one I'm joining, or if I'm even joining one at all. I don't know if it's against the rules to not join one, if I could just be like some rogue ninja or something. Um, it really all depends on what happens, just happens. Because um, I don't really have any plans for joining a village at this particular moment in time, but if a village decides to invite me to join them, then I will probably go ahead and think about it so there is that but i while i was exploring a bit i found this what, what's going on oh what is that what is that this ew, no no phoenix please or phoenix why did i call it a phoenix it's a sphinx run run away from that thing oh my goodness the naruto world has never been so so dangerous i like it but at the same time i don't Cause, oh no, oh no, oh no, we're running. Oh no, oh no, 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 it's a harpy and a, and a zombie and a sphinx and just everything chasing after me. Alright, we gotta, we gotta just run away. I was gonna explore this desert temple, but now I gotta like, holy crap, man. I gotta like bob and weave through everything just to explore this thing. Alright, so, hopefully I can outrun most of these things. I like how... It wasn't even until I started recording that all these monsters decided to pop out. Oh, are they still chasing after me? I feel like I'm pretty far away from them. They shouldn't be chasing after me anymore. Okay, so let's go ahead and just get whatever's inside of this desert temple. I think I saw that it wasn't damaged yet, so yeah, okay. We should be able to just go in there, steal all the goodies, and hopefully not blow up. All right, so let's get a stone pickaxe out. I stole a lot of stuff from that beginning house a lot of people were telling me that that's ginger's house and it might be like ginger's old house oh. okay never mind that was taken how did they get in oh my. someone must have gotten in because they broke here took all the tnt i'm gonna guess and say if i go down there there's not gonna be anything so eh should i should i test it out eh, i'll go ahead and test it out all right so in here there's no no there, there's nothing all right oh okay so now we're gonna have to break back out because I'm a fool and an idiot all at the very same time. Ugh, all right, let's get this going and start stacking. I should have taken these chests, but eh, whatever. It's not that big of a deal. But yeah, so like I said, I'm going to be starting my adventure in this episode. As you can see, I'm actually leaving the spawn, unlike in the first episode where I didn't really leave the spawn at all. I mean, I kind of did, and then at the very end of the episode, I swung back around and just went back to the village that was near the spawn. And over here is, is this supposed to be like some gravestone? Mitchie's cats. Leave them be or they will bite you. Doubt it. All right. Sorry. Sorry, Mitch. I'm going to go ahead and uh, steal your cat or whatever's in here. There's nothing in here. Wait. Maybe if I dig? No. No. There's there's literally nothing in Yeah, there, there's nothing in here. Okay. Well, now I... uh. Just gonna go ahead and break the rest of this, cause eh, screw it, screw it all. All right, and you guys can go ahead and tell him that I did that. I'd like to see him retaliate, even though he's probably ten times more powerful than I am. Actually, probably twenty times. I don't know how strong everyone else is on this series. This is my second episode. All right, so I'm gonna be exploring around a bit as I do that. Oh crap! Here comes these things that shoot eggs, or at least they used to shoot eggs. Do they still shoot eggs? We'll find out right now. Do they? No, they just come up to you. Wait, did they ever shoot eggs? I don't even know. I just have a memory of of saying that they shoot eggs. I, I really don't know. Okay. And, oh, I'm gonna die. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Alright. I love this bow and arrow. I just love it so much. Even though I'm gonna die because it's taking away my health just as much as it's taking away theirs. I still love it. I thought I killed another one. Why, why did I only get... Oh, well, this one's at full health, so I'm just going to run away because I feel like I'm going to die from my very own arrows. But yeah, like I said, I'm going to be exploring around a bit until I find a little place to settle down. I'll settle down for a couple episodes, make like a mini village or something. Nothing official, no official village. I'm not going to be an official Kage, so d don't even don't even make that like 
a possibility in the comments. Don't even say, screw the rules, be a Kage. No, that's, that's not how things work. There's going to be three Kages in this series, apparently. I only know of two. Well, the third one's supposed to be, like, my guy or something. I don't know if that's a joke or for real. Because if it's for real, then I, how is that going to work? Like, is, are they going to make a Mike Guy channel? Is a Mike Guy channel already created? What is that thing? Uh, we're going to go ahead and explore this thing. Okay. Uh, let's see what this is. I should probably be ki killing these cows for for uh, food, but whatever. All right, this is an obsidian tower. What is this? What is all of this? And by the way, on the way over here, I saw some stuff in the sky. There was like a green island in the sky. I'm guessing that was like a slime island or something. And then right next to it was something else. But my my way of thinking about things is everything has already been pretty much explored. Like anything that I've seen so far has already been explored. This is, is this man-made? Did I find another person's village? We're going to go ahead and, okay, wait, uh, let's. Stack up one more block. We're about to check this thing out. I don't know what this is, but if it's someone else's village, it looks pretty snazzy. Or is this just like an actual, like, is, is this from a mod? It looks kind, it looks like it could be from a mod, like an actual villager village, like fortress of sorts. I, I don't know what this is. It's already been explored, I think. I'm going to be stealing all these books. Just letting you know right now. All these books are mine. Unless they're someone else's. Oh, wait. Okay, I think this might be someone else's stuff. Never mind. I really don't know. There's no sign that says this is Zaro stuff or this is Ginger stuff or anything like that. So I really don't know. For now, I'll just leave it alone because I don't know who this belongs to. If it belongs to anyone, please tell me in the comments. All right, so we'll just keep exploring around. There's another desert temple over here. If this desert temple has been looted, then I can go ahead and guess that this might be someone's stuff, or either that or someone already came in here, took what they wanted, and left. So, uh, one, of those, one of those two things. I, I really don't know. Alright, let's just check inside here, and then I'll probably fade into where I will actually have a little place where I can settle down. Alright, so let's go in here. Yeah, this has already been explored. Okay. Alright, alright. I, I, I'm starting to get the gist of this. I gotta explore pretty far to get to an area where no one's been. Okay, I... What the heck is that thing? Wait, 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 wait. What is that? Every single time I'm about to fade out, I see something that piques my interest. What is this thing? Is this a giant monkey? Holy... What? <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, all right, we're running. Oh, I can't even run. No, 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 no. What, what is that thing? Holy... What is that thing? I gotta get a screenshot. Okay, I don't even care. I just gotta get a screenshot. Okay, wait, come closer to me, monkey. I know this thing's gonna kill. Holy crap, man. All right, we're running. We're running. We're going. See you later. Wait, I can I can leap or whatever it's called. Um, This is the newer version of the Naruto mod, so I can like hit X and I'll go. F yeah, yeah, take that. Well, it, that was a very anticlimactic escape right there. Is it still chasing after me? No. Alright, well, I'm never going there again. We're gonna be going- we're gonna shift our direction over to this area, because I don't know what that was. And I don't think I want to know what that was. At least not now. Maybe later on I'll come back here if I remember, but I, I probably won't. And there's a stupid Minotaurus. And, yeah, alright. I think we're at a good point to where we can actually fade into some- some actual living grounds. And I gotta kill these sheep to get- to get a bed, so. Alright, I'll see you guys when I'm in a good area and stuff and things. Okay, so... <laughs> I think I just stumbled upon someone's village. I... I was killing sheep right over here. Wait, where is it? Right over here. This area right over here. And I just kept walking in this direction, trying to find a good place to settle down. And then I just see a giant tree with some sugar cane planted around it. I'm like, that's not normal. Then we have some blocks over here. I was like, that's not normal. Then we have the Ars Magica stuff. The, the, <laughs> the Tinker's Construct thing. Oh, uh, okay. Well, we found someone's village. Lucky pig. Okay, what is this? For Ginger and Pat, please make sure you read what's inside. Well, uh, this is Ginger's village, apparently. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and just take a little sneak peek as to what's in here. So we're gonna, gonna just, uh, let's see. 
For Pan Ginger, I plan on moving my home to the other side of the village where the cave and nether portal are. I feel like I will be able to make an Ambu base a lot better there since it has a huge cave underneath the area. I have decided to make the Ambu base in my home the same thing. Uh, when I can, I'm going to take down my house here and start construction over there ASAP. I wanted to let you two know before someone took that spot. Thanks, Mitch. P.S. Once you read this book, put it back. All right. Well, this is the first village I've come across. I don't even know where the other village is, so I'm... Should, should I just like... Should I just be like, yo, guys, <laughs> let me live with you guys, eh? <laughs> I don't even know if they would accept me. I was... I was part of the... the alliance against them in the last server, so... I don't know. For now... Huh. Let's see, where can I live? I don't want to live too close to them in case they don't want me to live in their village. <laughs> um, what I could do is... Could I... I should... Huh. Alright, well first off, I'm going to be stealing some of their sugar cane unless I have a book on me. No, I don't have a book on me. I should have stole from the books that were over there back when I could have... Back when I had the chance. Oh well. So... Hmm. I'm gonna guess and say that they have all the materials that I need, so I'm gonna be stealing some of their materials. I'm sorry, Ginger, but I always steal all of your materials, apparently, because first episode I stole from your beginning place, and now I'm stealing from your actual village. And since I'm stealing from your actual village, if you say no to me being a member of your village, then this would turn very awkward. Very quickly. <laughs> Alright, so let's see. Oh, okay. We have some squid ink right here. I just need one. I'm sorry, Ginger. Just one. I'll, 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 I'll repay you with these. No, I'm not. I'm keeping the glasses. Uh, I'll repay you with. Well, I should probably put it in the right chest. All right, I'm gonna put this in here. And ooh, yeah, you like that acacia wood, eh? Okay, I'm keeping this. And um, what else? I need a feather. I have a feather on me, right? I don't even have a feather on me. What's wrong with me? Okay, let me get this. And then finally. I need a book. Just a good old fashioned. They have plenty of books. Okay. So we're going to put this cobblestone here. We're going to take one book. That's all I need. Now let me craft this book. And. I mean, this chest over here kind of says it all. Please make sure. Yeah. All right. So thanks, Mitch. I'm guessing that this is Mitch because it's pretty much them three living on here. All right. So I'm going to be like, yo, yo, yo. Homies. No. That, that, that's dumb. That's really dumb. I gotta make a good impression. Uh, yo, 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 is stained, because, you know, that's, that's hip and funky fresh. Alright, yo, yo, yo. It's me. Uh, sizzle. I was gonna put Cecil. <laughs> I was gonna put, yo, it's me, Cecil. No. Um, alright. Yo, it's me, Sizzle. I was wondering if you guys had room for one more. I am lost. I need protection from the Minot... How do you even spell... Is it Minotaur? Or is it Minotaur? I think it's like that. Alright, Minotaur! Um, from the Minotaurs. And the giant monkey. <laughs> I will behave... Myself, if you guys accept me into your village. If you don't want me as a perm member of the, of the village, I can just stay for as long as you are willing to to let me stay the end all right okay so that's going it wait let me let me sign this book um think about it winky face well dang it i can't even put a winky face uh think about it Winky face like that. I don't even care. I don't even care. You think I care about that space? I don't even care. All right. And that's going in here. Okay. Well. <laughs> For now, I will... I don't even know what. I'm going to be making a bed real quick. And I'm just going to put my bed down somewhere. 
Uh, like I said, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna overstay my welcome if they don't want me to stay for too long. I mean, it, it all really depends. I mean, if they want me to do some dirty deeds, I'll do some, well, it depends on how dirty. I mean, by dirty, I meant like, you know, some, some, some black ops, like some Ambu black ops type stuff. I mean, I could, I could, I could do some stuff like that. I wasn't talking about, uh, never mind. Never, never, just never mind. All right. <laughs> now let me make this bed. Okay. They should have a crafting table around here somewhere. Maybe. No? Alright, well, I'm gonna go ahead and place one down. You guys need a crafting table? Oh, they, they, have, they have four. Never mind. <laughs> there's a chest in this one already. Okay, there's something in this one. Alright, let's do this one. Alright, so we're gonna do that. And we're gonna change this into regular wood. And do some of this. Alright. So now I have to choose a place to just set up camp for now. Depending on what their answer is, I'll go off of that. But for now, this is just gonna be my little camp setup. All right, so let's just go up here. Let's see if they actually have anything up here. What is this light? Is there a beacon over here or something? What is this? What is what is this? Um, I'm very confused. All right, I'm gonna put my bed down over here, and then we're gonna explore this. All right, let's go to sleep real quick. If I if I there we go. I was gonna be like if I can maybe I don't really know. All right, there we go. We is good now. So. What is all of this stuff? All right, so is that a beacon? What what is all of this? All right, so we have a something over here, whatever that is over here. What is this thing? And then we have a bunch of buckets that I'm going to be taking cuz I mean, I need I need all this. Oh. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so very much. I'm going to be probably getting a horse now now that I have this. I should probably be taking the food as well. All right, see you later seeds. And then over here, this is, yeah, this is just a straight up beacon. Who made this? What is this? Is this just an extension of their, oh, this is, oh, this is where they do their lucky block stuff, I'm guessing, because this is straight up out of lucky blocks. Look up, yeah, this is, this, this is where they do their lucky block testing. I don't know what that thing is, but okay. So there's that, and what else do we have here? Uh, We have, whatever that, is that a castle? thing like an underground castle thing um we'll go ahead and explore that as well i guess what is there something whoa 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. okay all right i don't know what this is i don't know what this is but i can't get out of here now without stacking all right we're gonna be well, i hear something i hear some i hear some skellies there's some skellies inside of this i think all right so we're should we just break in here see what's inside i ain't scared of no skellies I ain't scared of no skellies. Oh, this is a straight up mob spawner. Okay. So that's what that is. All right. All right. Now chill, 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 chill. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. They're just attacking each other in there now. <laughs> okay. Let's just stack back out of here. I, I already said I wasn't going to be making enough. Uh, I, I wasn't going to be making any like noise or anything. And I'm over here messing with their, their stuff and placing down block. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Please let me into your village. Please let me into your cool kids club. Alright, is there anything else that we can explore in here? I should probably get started with the whole Ars Magica process, aka the way that we create jutsus. I mean, if you guys saw the first season, you guys would know what Ars Magica is. If you guys are tuning in for this season as the first season, for you- What is this? What is this? Uh, alright, we're gonna go ahead and check this out as I talk, but yeah, Ars Magica, if you guys don't know, is, it's, it's a mod that creates magic, and it's what we consider jutsus, because if you guys don't know, jutsus is Japanese for not only techniques, but also spells, so, it, it, it makes sense. One is lucky, one is not. What? Okay. And then, what is, what is this? Does anyone live here? Is this just some abandoned place? What? This is so weird. Okay, I could I could get down with this. Should I should I should have made this like abandoned building my camp for now? I think I I think I might do that. Huh? That'd be. Well, I mean, I have some more sheep right here, so I could just make another bed right over here. Yeah, I think I might make this abandoned building my little area for now until I find out an answer. I should have probably put exactly where I am living so that they can answer me back. Because <laughs> otherwise, how am I going to get an answer back? 
Uh, yeah, so I'm going to be running back to their village as soon as I'm done making another bed. And I'll do that. So I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, so here we go. <laughs> this is the next note that I'm going to be leaving them. Uh, let me go ahead and sign this. P.S. Alright, there we go. And... There. Alright. So hopefully with that, they'll leave a message back to me. I'll probably have to make like some kind of mailbox or something so that they can leave their answer back to me. But that's that. Alright, next thing's next. And the next thing is making an arcane compendium or whatever it's called. So for that I need liquid essence. Or whatever it's called. I, I don't even know what it's called anymore. It's like uh, liquid ethereum, something like that. I really don't know, but I need to find one of those ponds. I don't know where any of those would be, though. Uh, do I have some? No, that's milk. <laughs> I was going to be like, did I pick up some when I picked up those buckets? But no. All right, so that's my neck. Okay, for a second I was like, <gasps> are the hats back? Honestly, I love the hats from the last season. They were so good. All right. Let's see. I, I don't think I've seen... Uh, well, I mean, I haven't really been keeping my eyes out for liquid ethereum, or whatever it's called, so... I don't really know. I really don't. But I guess I'll look for some for a little bit. What the heck is this? What is this? Marble? Interesting. And what is that? Weed? Barley? Similar to weed, it grows in the wild. Oh, cool. All right. So, that's that. All right. I'm going to be looking for some liquid ethereum for a bit. If I can't find any, I'll just end off the episode. So, give me another second. All right. I found some of the... the, the liquid ethereum thing whatever it's called wait oh i i put my items away back in my new house so i can't even pick up any in a bucket and see what it's actually called but if i remember correctly to do this you put an item frame on a block and then a book yes it's actually working there we go we have the arcane compendium now sweet Sweet sweetness, you have unlocked the secrets of the arcane. Alright, so this now means that I can start doing jutsu, so I'll probably start those in the next episode. The only thing is, like I said in the last episode, um, we can only do two different natures now. So I've been thinking about it, and I was really keen on wind last time, like wind was my number one. So, but I also need something that's really good at attacking, so I'm thinking maybe... Lightning and wind? I don't know if anyone else has that already, and I don't know if we're not allowed to have what other people have or not, but lightning and wind seem like the two coolest for me because, well, wind was really convenient to travel with, it was it was really fast to travel with, and lightning pierced through a lot of armor, which is pretty cool, so that's why I chose those two. For now, I'll probably be working on wind before lightning, just in case someone tells me at some point that I can't do those two, and if I can't do those two, then I'll try something else. But wind is going to be my first priority, so that is that. Thank you guys- oh, by the way, and wind also means that I can be doing the Rasengan, so there's that. And lightning, I guess, could mean Chidori. But yeah, thanks for watching. I'm going back to my house. See you later. Bye.